Hey everyone, James Reeves, TFB TV. Right now, I am in Austria Arms, perhaps the finest gun store in the world. That's not an exaggeration. I'm here with my buddy, Martin. If you are in the Vienna area and you are a gun guy, you are completely missing out if you don't stop in here at Austria Arms. Also, make sure to check out their YouTube channel. Mm -hmm. It's in German though, right? Right, it's in German. It's in German, yeah. so you know, turn on the captions, but uh, I'll link that in the description if you want to check it out. Again, love this place. Many of you watch TFB TV Showtime. That is our show coverage channel. And if you watched it from EWA and Force Tech this year, then you saw the Alpha, Alpha Pro Ye. That's how I say it, right? Yeah, Alpha, Alpha Pro. I, I do not know how to pronounce it the right way, but. James Reeves, TFB TV here at EWA in Nuremberg. I'm with my friend Thomas with Alpha Pro Ye. I'm a redneck, so it's, you know, it's P R O J. So yeah. it's like, I, that's, to me, yeah. that's Alpha Proj. But, you know, I, I realize that you Europeans pronounce things differently. So, in any event, we were talking, I think the Alpha Pro Ye guys, they make uh, Czech revolvers that are yeah. pretty reasonably priced. Mm. And what caught my eye there is they had carbines. They were like revolver yeah. carbines. And I'm like, okay, well, this seems kind of silly. And they said, no, 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 James, stupid American, you don't understand that we've got kind of messed up laws here. So you can have this revolver carbine and you don't need a certain license or a certain background check. It, it, it's a way of getting around some European gun laws. So we have, this is an Austria arms deal. You guys are, are putting this together. It's not even out yet. Maybe by the time this video is released, it will be. But I, I guess mm -hmm. it, it's unnamed, so we're yeah. calling it the Space Cowboy right, yeah. Revolver. <laughs> but this is a continuation of that mm -hmm. Alpha Pro Ye, those regular carbines that we saw that just had kind of like the regular wooden thud, stocks, yeah. yeah, wooden stocks and like a little grip on it. This is like the tactical version. Exactly, the yeah. Space Cowboy, walk us through it, Martin. What is it? Well, we really like the Alpha Pro, or how do you pronounce Whatever, it? Whatever. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, the, the revolver carbine. It. Yeah, it's a yeah. cool gun, and in Austria it's also quite popular because you can uh, buy it without uh, blocking a space on your gun permit, because mm -hmm. for semi-automatic guns you have to block a space on the gun permit and you're limited to two spaces. I can buy as yeah. many of these as I want. With the carbine, yes. And we saw the carbine would have a lot of potential. I mean, look at the size. You have a 10-inch barrel mm -hmm. in 9x19 or... 357 Magnum and 10 inch 357 Magnum is quite a lot of energy. You oh, can yeah. Oh, get yeah. Get out of it. And the usual, oh, the original carbine doesn't really have a scope mod, for right. instance. And we thought how to make this gun better or more tactical or mm -hmm. more usable. Mm -hmm. yeah. And then we came up with the idea of making this chassis, which gives you M lock slots all over the place so you can mount like your surefire light or right. everything else, uh, a laser or whatever, right, 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 to right. make it more tactical. Let your imagination run wild with Exactly, this. Yeah. yeah. Then you have a full top picket in your rail so you can mount a rat or even up to an LPV or a uh -huh. scope uh -huh. yeah, and use the full potential of that barrel and, mm -hmm. yeah, and shoot up to 100 meters yeah, or more. Screw it, throw a 1 to 10x on there, right? Yeah, why yeah. not? I mean, <laughs> yeah, why would, not? Would fit, yeah. <laughs> then you have the compensator, uh -huh. yeah, which uh -huh. I mean, gives it a bit cooler look. The compensation of that is not... Well, and, and this is probably very mild to shoot. 357 exactly, yeah. Magnum carbine with a buttstock, and then you've got the, the compensator on there, Makes too. Makes it even softer yeah. to shoot, yeah. Yeah, yeah, so sure. You have a lot of space here to mount whatever you want, and then we came up with the metal back part here, which gives you also the ability to put on two speed loaders. That's so clever. Yeah. That is so, so funny. When you are out of ammo, you can just pop it out here and stick it in, and then you're good to go and continue shooting. And then we have some extended um, levers here with the mag release or the drum release basically. Right, right. And then also here this lever when you are mounting a scope or so that you can easily... Right, cock the hammer. So yeah. I mean that's brilliant. You basically integrated oversized controls mm -hmm. to factor in that people are going to be using this in si uh, sort of a carbine yeah. style setup. So I can easily get to my cylinder release right here. I can easily with my index, index or, yeah. or thumb I can get to the hammer. So I, I think this is really clever. These are both the same, right? You just have this one configured, like yeah. all tricked out. Exactly. It's hilarious to me because like I'm looking at the components knowing what they cost and the yeah. components <laughs> probably cost more than the gun itself. <laughs> so I see that this mounts up as uh, basically the stock you have mounting through the grip, right? Like replacement grip panels, is that um, how that works? Yeah, kind of replacement grip panels and um, the original Revolver Carbon has this extended um, frame here, which gives it the right. overall length to um, confirm with the law. And with the screws here, you can mount the skeletonized rear. 
end as well. Uh, this is so funny. I mean, this is a, a, such a brilliant thing. When do you guys think that you're going to be producing these or selling them? Yeah, beginning of 24. That's uh -huh. so the, the target, maybe around the IVA show. Are they coming as complete guns or are you just selling the kits? Well, we're selling the kits and we probably also will sell it complete configured with the kitted out thing. You're going to, uh, Martin, I hate to ask because we're such good buddies. Yeah. I don't want you to be mad at me. Everyone gets mad when I ask how much it costs when it's not been real. I knew it. See, it's that's a always the reaction. It's a difficult question because right now we're still on the phase where it's not produced yet. But our aim is to sell the chassis for around 500 to 600 bucks uh -huh. completely with, uh -huh. with all the accessories. Uh -huh. And then the revolver, just ballpark. How much does an Alpha Pro A revolver well, carbine they, run? They are between 1200 to 1400 Mm -hmm. depending on the price, but I think altogether you're around two grand. Okay, yeah, right and there. then you don't have to use up a slot on your, your gun exactly, license yeah. certificate. So that's really the main takeaway here. And this is something that's absolutely viable for home defense or plink game absolutely. or it's hunting small game, whatever. Super so easy to use, yeah. I, I saw it, it caught my eye when we were walking through the revolver yeah. room. I'm like, oh my God, I, I knew what it was yeah. because I, having seen the revolver carvings earlier yeah. this year, I was like, okay, these guys just took it and brought it to the next level. Yeah. Martin, this is really clever, man. Thank you for showing yeah. this to us, guys. If you want to see one in person or if you want to buy one, then head over to Austria Arms here in Vienna. Thank you for watching. See you, Space Cowboy.